How did I turn this video into this without complex video effects? I'm gonna teach you how to use Runaway Gen 1. First part is to record your video. You can use your iPhone, this doesn't need to be high production. Just be chill and focus on the movements and the composition. And please, don't worry about looking silly. I was literally dodging cars in the road. Some people probably judge me, but without realizing what I was creating for you and the impact we're having here. So just do you. The next step is to create a reference image in Mid Journey. This is what Gen 1 will use as inspiration for the video effects. Here's some tips. Try to match the composition of this image to your original video. Focus on the lighting and the style. Your reference image should also be a square. And once you get this reference image, you should be able to use it across all of your clips. Here's the picture and the prompt that I used. Now we're going to go to runwayml.com. Click into AI Magic Tools, select Gen 1, upload your video here and your reference image here. Down here you can play with the settings. For my video, I lowered the structure to zero. This keeps the structure of the original video intact. You can only process up to five seconds of video at a time, so I cut my video into clips and did this process with each one. Next is the editing. I exported all the clips out and put them into CapCut. To get the effect where I'm walking into clones of myself, go to Style, Video Effects, Freeze Frame 1. This speed ramping effect is called Auto Velocity, also in the Video Effects styles. For this transition back into real life, I just match the cuts, then use the Dissolve 1 transition. I really hope this helps. I'm Dominic, Mr. Grateful. Peace.